The capital city district is a key project of Abu Dhabi Plan 2030, a monumental planning initiative envisaged by the late Sheikh Zayed bin Sultan Al Nayyan to guide the ongoing evolution of Abu Dhabi as a global capital city. Located between Mohammed bin Zayed City and Abu Dhabi International Airport, the capital city district will serve as a second downtown for Abu Dhabi and be home to 370,000 residents. The design of the capital district symbolically links national government, city life and Emirati culture through the creation of distinct districts and national institutions connected by grand boulevards, walkable streets, monumental spaces and a world-class public transit system. At the city's centre, a radial pattern of streets surrounds a central monumental space. A series of seven grand boulevards, representing the seven emirates, connect this symbolic centre with surrounding districts, large civic institutions and regional access routes. The monumental capital boulevard provides a beautiful and dramatic connection between the presidential palace and the Grand Mosque on Abu Dhabi Island. The Capital District Master Plan is based on creating culturally rich, vital, architecturally attractive and sustainable urban form for this new capital. At the heart of the Capital District will be a federal precinct, which will serve as the national seat of government for the United Arab Emirates. Federal ministries and government offices will lie in the Capital Boulevard and be designed to respond to the unique desert culture and climate of Abu Dhabi. Adjacent to the Capital Boulevard, national institutions, embassies and diplomatic housing will reinforce the importance of the Capital District through distinctive public architecture and a strong diplomatic presence. Along primary boulevards and at gateways to the city and the central business district, monuments and public spaces will reinforce the city's ceremonial and symbolic function. Landmark buildings will emphasize the skyline at important radial axes and will be opportunities for extraordinary architectural design expression. Capital Boulevard will be lined with national institutions and commemorative sites and will serve as the main processional route through the city, providing space for the parades, celebrations and events that are an integral part of the life of a capital city. The Capital District will become a center of learning and excellence. It will be home to new universities, a medical campus, and biomedical research facilities. The 65,000-seat Halifa National Stadium will be surrounded by a variety of sports, retail, hotel, and entertainment uses, making it a vital and integrated part of the city. A multi-purpose exhibition and conference space, concert hall, and hotels will provide space for major conventions, events, and performances. A world-class transportation system will connect neighborhoods within the capital district and connect the district to the wider region. The system will include high-speed rail, metro rail, a surface network of trams and buses, and a fine-grained interconnected network of streets and sidewalks. The regional rail will connect the capital district with Al Ain, Dubai, the airport in downtown Abu Dhabi. A multimodal transportation hub will provide a world-class interchange for metro, fast train, trams, buses and taxis, and be a focal point for high-density retail and office development in the central business district. Metro stations will be conveniently located within walking distance of the highest density areas in order to serve the largest population and reduce reliance on driving. Transit-oriented development at each station will provide a range of housing, shopping, employment and community services. An extensive and interconnected network of trams throughout the majority of the city will ensure that no resident is less than a five-minute walk from transit. The plan for the capital district continues and extends Abu Dhabi's traditional urban grid with an interconnected street system designed to encourage walking, especially for short distances. Dedicated bike routes will be integrated into the streetscape and offer opportunities for safe and convenient travel across the city. Central to the plan for the capital district is the commitment to create a sense of community, 
The plan seeks to preserve the traditions, heritage and way of life of Emiratis and is flexible enough to accommodate the needs of the Emirates' diverse population, ensuring everyone can live and work in peace and harmony. The Central Business District will be the second downtown for Abu Dhabi and will combine a dense mix of uses including high-density office towers, hotels, residential neighbourhoods, shopping and community services to encourage a balance of jobs to residents. The National Mosque District will provide a variety of medium-density housing options intertwined with vibrant open spaces and community and cultural uses. A National Mosque will preserve the nation's Islamic identity and local government offices will anchor a major civic open space. The International Souk Market District will be a symbolic centre for the city. It will have a high concentration of fine-grained retail development and cultural uses and be a popular tourist destination. South of the Federal Mosque District is the lower density Emirati neighbourhood which will provide housing for nationals. Each neighbourhood cluster features a retail centre, mosque, schools and local parks, so that residents are within a short distance of their daily needs. Along the north and south spines, higher density development nodes are clustered around each metro station. Major medical complexes and healthcare facilities will serve the capital district and surrounding region. A hierarchy of open spaces, from large commemorative places to civic plazas to neighbourhood parks, will provide a focus for national and local celebrations and be accessible to all residents within a five-minute walk. Each neighbourhood in the capital district will be well served by community services and amenities, including service stations, cultural centres, youth centres, post offices, women's centres, libraries and mosques. Schools have been provided within close proximity to all neighbourhoods, serving the Emirati and expatriate school-aged population well into the future. The new capital will be planned for future generations to enjoy a livable and sustainable city. Streets and open spaces are laid out to maximise shade and channel afternoon breezes, the design of landscapes will reflect the desert environment of Abu Dhabi and conserve our precious water resources. Buildings will be designed to meet the highest Estadama standards for water, energy and waste reduction and streets will be shaded with canopies, arcades and trees to lower temperatures and maximise the comfort of outdoor spaces. The Master Plan Developed by the Abu Dhabi Urban Planning Council is designed to manage the development of this new city through a long-term vision. It represents a unique opportunity to create an authentic modern Arab capital that will shape the future of our region. Our objective is to make Capital City District an environmental, social and economically sustainable community that will preserve and promote the Emirates' unique culture. By thinking and acting ahead, we will deliver on our promise and make a difference to the individual lives of our next generation.